this is the vacuum system for my 82 1.5 liter Civic CVCC. Okay, so let's start with this bugger here. On the outside, firewall side, we have a row of five of them. They just connect real easy. Just in the same order, top is the top on these five on this uh, gang here. On the inside, we'll start this top one here connects to the top one here. The second one is a little fatter. That connects to the second one. The lowest one, the five, connects here, this top one that comes across and turns into the white dot hose that connects to this diaphragm here. On the, there's one that splits off and turns in, that's a 16 that comes and connects to this diaphragm here. Uh, and there's the charcoal canister which is a 7 that connects to the lowest here this 19 which is right above it kind of comes up as a T right there that 19 circles around and connects to the left side of the choke that inside is an 18 that comes up to this T right here and then that's also an eight that off of that T comes this 18 which is the second one in this gang then coming off of that we come down we have the 17 and 19 there just right and left same thing connects down below right and left also you see that yellow guy right there it's also right and left and the top connects right and left nothing tricky uh, here on uh, coming right off that base that the carburetor sits on there's a T and the right side comes off and it connects to this one on the distributor and on the other side is a little fatter and that comes off and connects to the lower one here I believe that's all on this side oh wait uh, no that's it okay so then on the back side of the carb it's a little harder to see but there's this one which is a 3 and this one here which is a 15 you can see it kind of jogs and connects right there and they both connect just inside yeah. just below this um, this fat hose here they both connect just right up inside right under that the uh, that red hose that connects there whatever color your might be comes under here and also connects to the charcoal canister then that other fat one that's right above that connects to that pipe can see there which what comes around on this side and is the center of these two on the other side which we'll get to when we go there okay so then you have these two fat ones on top they're pretty obvious the longer goes to longer shorter to the shorter pretty clear so let's go to the other side real quick 
continue where we left off. Now you can see the diaphragm just back in there. It's got a six, or maybe that's a nine, which connects. It goes right up and connects there. Pretty obvious. Um, those fat ones here, those two come around and they connect here. This one is the third one that goes up and it connects here. This is labeled on here. So this is C, B is on top, A is on the bottom. A, B, C. So C's there, B, A. Okay, these two are your fuel lines. Should go into a fuel filter, which you want to replace if you took off the carb. Okay, so then we have this vacuum box. There's one that's below it, and that connects very obviously right there into that gang okay coming out of here we have the the inner one which comes down right under those hoses and connects here on this copper pipe and you want it to go underneath if you put that on top once you put the air filter on it'll crush it and pinch that hose so you want to make sure it goes down in between these two okay next we have the green one, which comes right off and connects there. The yellow right next to it. And the one that's just under those two connects right there. I mean, that's really clear cut and obvious. Okay, then we have these two hoses that connect here on that gang, that metal. The top one. connects right here. The lower of the, those two connects right down there at the base of the carb. Then off of that that base plate there you have a big fat hose and that goes off into a, a split and you got a 10 and a 20 and those two connect. Uh, kind of hard to see here. They connect right there on the lowest part of right there. So the outer ten connects to the the top of those two, the 20 on the lower. Okay, and then right off of that plate is this one that's going to be loose. That comes up and connects to um, just right there in the bottom of the um, this little plastic thing on the bottom of the air filter. Okay, so and the first one on this side is this fat one comes up connects to the stop valve here second one is that long green one that went to the other side there which pointed out and came over here that's the second one and then this the furthest one out is this one which connects to a vacuum connection under um, the air filter and right next to that is where this guy connects also in the thing underneath the air, air cleaner, air filter assembly. Uh, let's see, anything left? Uh, I think that's all of the vacuum and fun stuff under here. Uh, let's just take a slow tour in case there's anything I didn't say that you can see oh I didn't mention this one. Oh yeah the, the stop valve is this 15 
the vacuum on the stop valve is this 15 that goes right under there connects right here this guy and the one next to it is that that green tag that went all the way over there and comes over and connects number two here. Yeah. Everything is pretty straightforward. Unless you've really messed with your hoses. It, it pretty much just are really obvious where they want to go. The only couple I found that weren't obvious or you could get confused is maybe these two. But again, so I'll just point that out that this one here connects into the choke. This diaphragm over here just loops underneath and connects to the second one on this gang. Okay, and then this one that goes down, that T comes up is the one that connects to this di on, the, on the side of the distributor also the only other questionable one if you had it all loose and you couldn't quite tell would maybe be this 16 that comes off here that one swings around and connects to this diaphragm and this 7 to this lowest part here if you had them all off you might get those two switched but so the charcoal canister 7 to the lower of this metal pipe. The 16 here to the diaphragm. Everything else is pretty clear cut. But you never know. So let me just give you a gander. Slowly on this side. Good luck.